Assalamualaikum. Hi guys. So today I'm gonna show you my lazy makeup routine because um this is basically what I will do on days that I feel like I don't want to wear too much makeup but I still want to look presentable because I'm like lazy to put a lot of effort in the morning. So this is what I will do for my like makeup routine every day. So keep watching. I've prep my face with my serum, moisturizer, um, sunscreen. Um, next, I will take my It Cosmetic CC Cream. Um, a friend actually recommended this to me um, on her Insta story, saying that this is suitable for dry skin. Um, but what I like about this is that it doesn't break me out. It's very hard to find a product that will not break me out and do the job, you know. Um, and it doesn't feel heavy, um, it, it has SPF, so um, it's kind of it's very good. So I've had this since March 2019 and today is like February 2020 and I still have it. Even though I use this every single day. Put this much um, and then stick a brush. Any brush. <laughs> I'll take my this is okay so I broke the, the the cap so this is all I have um, if I'm traveling I will like put it in, in the ziplock yeah so this is um, Rimmel cosmetic powder my beauty guru is Ellie I don't know how to pronounce her name but basically um, she recommended this she recommended this she recommended all the products that I'm using. Um, I just like pick the one that suit my preference and my um, style of makeup. Um, so that's it. So um, this is actually a matte powder, so it should not make your face look oily. I notice that when I'm in Malaysia, my face tends to be more oily than when I'm in Canada. That's why I bought this thing because when in Canada, my face was dry. It's like combination dry and when I'm here, it's like mostly combination oily. So um, this comes in because I don't bake. Uh, I don't have or own any loose powder. So I just use this um, for the area that um, will become oily at the end of the day. Blush. Um, so <laughs> funny story. I don't know why when it's like drugstore makeup. This, like their cover is not gonna stay there forever. Maybe I'm just like, too reckless, but um, anyway. So this is Essence Mosaic, Mosaic, Mos Mosaic blush in the shade of All You Need Is Pink. Really get the product in the blush, uh, in the brush. Tap it, and then I like doing this. What I like about this blush is that. It's not shimmery. Um, I have like uh, the wet and wild blush. But the thing about that blush is that it's kind of very glittery. Um, it's good for for the look that I want um, to look like extra dewy, you know. But um, because my face tends to be oily, I just don't like that finishing. So I prefer a matte finishing here. Mm. And um, what I like, another thing about this product is that it covers all my pores. I have like huge pores around this area and it just cover it. So um, as you can see, I don't have um, a nice brow. Uh, it needs some tweak here and there. This eyebrow pencil, which I forgot. <laughs> Where did I get it? Um, I don't remember because um, the brand thing is worn out um, so. 
and I find it really good so I might have some trouble in this finish using Essence Make Me Brow set your brow and then fill it in more um, I kind of like it if my brow look all bushy and not not properly made, you know, because I feel more authentic and like effortless. So lazy. So done with the brow. Next, I will do my lashes. Um, the thing about me, it, it was like um, a phase when I was in after high school. I love putting on eyeliner because I'm like, you know, like gothic, um, like gothic girl with like thick eyeliner. And then I realized <laughs> when I grow up, I just don't like it. Um, wait, I'm gonna come back with my curler. I have my curler here. Um, I'm lucky that I was born with long lashes but not lucky enough to have it curled up, you know, so I need this. If people ask me to convert to any high-end product for mascara, I will say no because number one, you gotta save some money. Number two, this has done its purpose. So, um, this is from Essen Lashes Princess. Um, this is also... Uh, being recommended by another YouTuber. So for me, I don't like waterproof mascara because it's just so hard for me to remove it and especially when like at the office and, and I have to pray Zohor um, during lunch. It's just, it just so troublesome to like remove it. Um, it will take a longer time for me. So with this mascara, I just I just leave it like that on my like eye makeup. I don't put any eyeliner. So that's all for my face and my um, eyes. Um, lastly, it's just my um, my lips. I'm gonna show you how I finish this look with a lipstick. You know, lip cream. Sorry. So this one is from Silky Girl. Every time I post a selfie of me before going to work um, after I've, I've done my makeup um, there will be like some replies asking on what lipsticks do I wear to work um, so this is it this is the only lipstick that I'm wearing to work the thing about me is that I don't use any lip liner um, I just fill it in like from the bottom and then growing up and I just took it like once and then I built it. I just that I just like don't keep taking more products. It's just that one time and then just fill it in. Usually I would end it with like setting spray and everything, but um, I'm running out of my setting spray so I just go out like this. Um, and if I have my setting spray on after it like dries out, I would wear another powder on top and this is another tips from um, the beauty guru that I've been following on YouTube um, she recommended this uh, Milani product um, I don't know if they have it here um, but in Canada this is actually an awesome product a bit on the on a, like pricier range of the drugstore product but um, it's good so this is actually the prep set and glow Illumin illuminating transparent powder uh, what it does it's like setting your makeup, but uh, give you that dewy finishing. Um, so because I haven't put like any powder around my cheek area, so usually I would focus on that area, and then and then just just dab it around my face. So that's the only step. Um, I don't know how many steps are there, but um, I feel like that's very simple doable and it will take me only like five minutes um, it's not showing here like for five minutes because I, I'm like chatting with, with you um, but 
to be honest like if I wake up late if I wake up early this is the only thing that I will do before I head up to work and it makes my face look presentable not heavy um, and this makeup actually lasts me um, a very long time so I hope you guys find it useful and um, thank you for watching uh, leave down any comments uh, down below or like more things that you want to see from me and um, don't forget to subscribe and give a big thumbs up thanks guys bye